it was tough. Anything you want to do that people don't understand, it's tough. In this city, there is so much wealth. There are so many people with so much money. We tapped almost all of them through our network of friends. And nobody understood. They said, you know, but what's the return on investment? If we invest this money in a plot of land, we will make X amount. But investing in young people, they didn't see it. So the first person or the first organization to listen to us was Google. Google has a division called Google for Entrepreneurs. Uh, the lady who heads it was here um, in Pakistan. And so I spoke to her and I said, listen, we want to do this. She said, why? I said, well, you know, this is a country of over 200 million people. There will never be enough jobs for all these young people. And so we need to create opportunities. They need to create jobs and they need to create jobs not just for themselves, but for others like them. So she said, okay. She understood that right away. And then she said, why Karachi? She said, Karachi is this country's largest city with the largest youth population. So they said, okay, how much money do you need? Now that's a question you don't want to be asked. You are not prepared for. And we weren't. So we quickly sort of did some mental math and said, okay, we need you know, X amount of money. And she thought and she said, okay, we'll give you half that. And the only reason we're giving you half the money, Google can afford to give you all of it. But we want this to be your space owned by you, not owned by Google, just supported by Google. That makes sense. So then, but there was a proviso. You will only get that money if you find the rest of the money. <laughs> now that's, <laughs> that was a problem. So we went looking again, went to some large organizations, went to the government, which actually had a fund which supports this kind of activity. No luck. So then we found another foreign organization, Samsung, who did not understand what we were doing. All they understood was that if Google's in it, it must be something that they should be a part of, which suited us fine. So we had the money now and we were able to start this. And then. You know, when you have money, people are willing to give you money. We got a call from the U.S. State Department to say, why don't you, um, you know, there's an entrepreneurship grant, why don't you apply for it? You know, being of the mindset that I was, we need X amount of money, we've got it, why should we even bother? So that's what I told them, that listen, we have the money we need, we don't need any more. That's quite stupid because you can never have enough money to do this kind of activity. But anyway, they insisted, so... We filled out a form and about three months later, we had the, the grant that we needed. So now we had more than enough money and we went about setting up the space.